Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new, hi, hello, I'm Caitlin, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing a what's on my iPhone 11. I have it in the purple color. I don't know if you can see it, but I have it in the purple color. Super, super pretty. And then I just have this durable case that I got from Amazon. Let me start the screen recording. So this is my lock screen. Nothing too, too special. I just, it's just all black and the clock and everything is pink and I absolutely love it. But let's just go to like the side part right here. I just have flip clock. I have a weather calendar. I have the Bible app. Which the verse of the day is Luke 6.35 and it says Love your enemies, do good to them, lend to them without expecting to be repaid. Then your reward from heaven will be very great and you will truly be acting as children of the Most High. For he is kind of to those who are unthankful and wicked. So that is the Bible verse for today. And then I just have this widget, it is the 444 uh, angel number. It is protection. It also shows that you are surrounded by angelic protection in addition to receiving the necessary strength to move forward. And then there's a widget next to it and it says focus on your goals. And then we have the motivation app and it just says what makes me angry. Comment down below what makes you angry. <laughs> and then I just have another one and it just says YouTuber. And then I have Spotify and then another widget, love widgets. It says create a life you can't wait to wake up to. And then I have the countdown app. I have 44 days left until it's my last year, last first day of school. Well, high school, because I'm going to college. And then we have the battery thing. Yes, my phone is about to die, so that's why we need to kind of hurry up a little bit. And then we are on my first page, and I just have this widget. It has the time, the day, and my battery percentage in pink, of course. And then we have another widget, but it's an I am app. It says the only validation I need is within myself, period. And then we have the first one, which is essentials, a little folder. It has photos, camera, Google Photos, App Store, Maps, and weather. And then we have social, which is FaceTime, TikTok, Pinterest, you can go follow my TikTok and my Pinterest. It will be on the screen and linked in the description. And then we have Workplace. I use that for work. YouTube Studio. If you don't know what YouTube Studio is, almost every YouTuber has it. Yes, I know my phone is about to die. But it just shows you your subscribers, your views, your watch time, how much money you're getting paid, and all of that. And then you have YouTube Tracker, which pretty much does the same thing. And then you have Live360 and then TubeBuddy. And now we have the editing folder. Um, Pixart, I use it for my thumbnails. VLLO, I use for my to edit my videos. Canva, I also use. And Fonto, I also use for my thumbnails. And then CapCut, I recently just downloaded that because some people say it's good for editing your YouTube videos, so I'm going to try it out. <clears throat> and then we have games. I have Helix Jump, Crossy Road, Amaze, Coin Master, Solitary. Black Hexa, another solitary game, and Subway Surf. Solitary, I absolutely love playing solitary before I go to bed. I don't care if that makes me old. I love solitary. Like, I will never stop playing solitary, dude. Like, that, it just brings me so much joy. Literally. And then, we have the Shop app, which breaks my bank account. But it's okay. So, we have Amazon. We have American Eagle, we have Shein, pretty sure everybody knows what Shein is. We have, <clears throat> why does my voice sound like that? It's so raspy. <clears throat> and then we have Hollister, we have Fashion Nova, we have Shop, which if you don't know what Shop is, it basically just, instead of like going to like different apps to see like when your package is coming, you just go to this, and my package comes July 12th next Wednesday but it basically just you put the tracking number in the shop app and it tracks your package without going to the individual app that you bought it from and then we have Plato's Closet and then we have Rainbow Shops now we have education we have mail 
We have Classroom, Google Classroom. We have Notes, Gmail, GroupMe. I used GroupMe when we went to Kings Island as like the school field trip. And then we have Calculator. We have Reminders, Grammarly, Quizlet, Quizzes, and Kahoot. And then we have Movies. We have YouTube. You guys should totally subscribe. I really appreciate it. And then we have Netflix. My favorite shows as of right now would have to be SWAT. I, I'm on season 1 episode 22 of SWAT. And then New Amsterdam. I'm on season 1 episode 13. It's a pretty good show. Y'all should go watch it. And then we have Paramount Plus. I don't think I'm watching anything on Paramount Plus right now. Oh, I guess I am. I'm watching Guidance. But I'm on season 1 episode 1, so I don't really know. I don't know about that one. And then I'm watching NTIS Hawaii, season 1, episode 13. Ghosts, season 1, episode 8. Blaze and the Monster. I watch cartoons when, to fall asleep too because it helps me. Like when I have a bad dream, I gotta put cartoons on just so I don't, you know, get scared. But then we have music app. We have podcasts. We have Shazam. Shazam is basically like if somebody... Like, you're in a car with somebody, or, like, a party or whatever, and you don't know the song, you could just get the little app, click that button, and it shows you what song is playing without asking the person what the song is. And then we have Spotify, and then we have Apple Music. And then I have another little widget. It says, Trust Your Intuition. We have another widget. It says, Stars Can't Shine Without Darkness. And then we just have my Reminders app. And then we have health. I feel like I'm saying and then, and then, and then. My girl. And then... <laughs> okay. I'm done. I'm done. So we have the health app. The flow, which is a period tracker. And then we have just fit. Because girl, I need to start working out. And then we have fitness to go. Starbucks, DoorDash. I literally DoorDash so often. It's like whoever invented DoorDash, you were OG right there. And then we have McDonald's and we have Fetch. Fetch is pretty much just like take all your receipts and you scan them and you get points for them. We have just widgets where I like I get like you know all the cool fun widgets on my phone. We have Flip Clock. We have color widgets and widget tubble. We have auto, which is just cars.com, because I like to look at cars. We have faith, which is the Bible, practice, devotional, I'm pretty sure, and then daily prayer. We have travel, because I like, to, when I'm bored, I like to go in here and think I'm buying an apartment or a house, or I'm going on a cruise or like something like that. So we have realtor.com, Carnival, Universal, Fly Delta, and Priceline. We have language, is dictionary vocabulary and translate because believe it or not i used to like spelling and like i always got 100 percent on my spelling in elementary and middle school because I'm, I'm a g like that and then we have beauty which is ulta bath and body works sephora elf cosmetics and ipsy we have grocery walmart sam's club and ikea ikea it's like furniture, but like, they got a lot of stuff there. And then we have live events, Fandigo, Adam, and Smart Home. Fandigo and Adam, it's um, like theaters, like movies, see what movies are playing that night and stuff. And then we have finances. We have wallet, daily pay, shift days, hours tracker, and boost one. We also have a color widget which it says don't die wondering the little bar at the bottom there's phone safari this little widget right here which is utilities clock calendar stocks settings shortcuts which shortcuts should probably be in the widgets folder but that's fine and then we have reminders books calculator compass voice memos translate and color widgets and then we have messages and then it's just like the the little bar, the app library. That is it for my phone. I bought this phone with my own money and I'm very proud of it. And I absolutely love this phone. The iPhone 11. 
64 gigabytes, I believe. It's a good phone. So if you want the iPhone 11 or you want a new phone that you don't already have, like the the expensive ones, like the 14, 13, I think there's going to be a 15 soon. Like, girl, only one of these cameras work. Like, be so for real. But that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure you subscribe down below to your post notification bell on so you will get notified every time I post a new video. Yeah. I'll see you in my next video.